What is up guys, Astronox here for a Summoner's War video on Necropolis B10. So, my team is not, uh, I mean, it's not a speed team, but uh, it, uh, it works out pretty well most of the time. Uh, I mean, success rate is, uh, was it at least like 90%? Grego is, is just a crazy hero. The problem with this setup is that when, when Grego gets taken, <coughs> because he ends up doing like a bunch of damage, he, um, he can be pretty annoying to kill since he receives uh, half damage. His uh, passive makes it so he takes 50% less damage, he also receives 50% less healing. But uh, I really like him. Like in Guild Wars, Grego and Chasun are just like crazy together. Uh, during the trash, the problem that can happen is uh, when you're fighting the Grego boss here. You know, uh, Grego is. Uh, his skill, his uh, his second skill is random. It can hit from uh, like three to four times, and it has like 25% chance to apply a defense break. Uh, so if he like ends up putting defense break on the first hit, and then all three hit like, or even two hit hits the same target, it's, it's pretty much over. That target's dead. So for the multi-hitters, Hua, um, Hua's on violent, uh, like Shilling's on violent, Grego's on violent, Rigel, the Water Lich is uh, is on violent as well. Uh, actually, I cannot remember if. Uh, What's her name? Fire Har uh, Harpu? Harpy? Fire Harpy? If she's on violent, actually. <clears throat> I don't think she is. I have the setup so, like, it, it tries to kill the, the, like, whoever gets taken. You, you need some like, a crazy setup if you just stay on the boss. Also, with the way the the liches attack, it's like it, it's it's random. So might as well just focus on uh, focus on whoever gets taken because uh, I mean it, it just end up that you don't do enough damage and then yeah, another a second one gets taken and it's over at that point. It's a slow run right there. Colleen, yes, Colleen. So Hua, Hua does uh, one one hit on her first attack, two hit on her second attack. Uh, Colleen, she's got like uh, double and triple attack. Chilling's always triple attack unless he's buffing, then he does nothing. Uh, Grego can go from. Two to four attack and he's violent. Uh, I believe Rigel's about the same thing. Two to four attacks. It's 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 random. Skill one and skill two have different amounts. Skill skill one is like two to three. Skill two is like three to four. Uh, 
like I already have chilling for Dragon B10, so I figured like might as well use him also. You need a slow you need a slow in this uh, against this guy because it's just uh, it makes a big difference. Another thing is uh the speed buff. I mean chilling is just amazing. He provides a slow, Hua provides a slow. Um and then when you slow him and you have a speed buff, it just makes it so you like like 50% faster than him. You can just get a bunch of turns in. Now Rigid got got stake got taken, so it's easier to down him. Also chilling gives the crit rate buff and I'm using Hua lead so I can cap my crit rate on, uh, on all the DPS heroes easily. I've ran more uh, dangerous setups. That's probably how I got my times. I can't remember exactly what I was running. Mm. I'll just keep that for now. Never know, maybe it runs a uh, roll 6-6 six, six into the st same stat. Uh, since it's rage, preferably, I mean, speed, crit rate, yeah, but even if you get the plus 12 speed, still uh, really nice. <coughs> Instead of Grego, you could run just like uh, another Lich, like uh, Fire or Wind. I think people run, yes, they, they run Wind most of the time here with the uh, original the Water Lich. My, my original is not, uh, his skills are not maxed. But uh, all the other ones, the, all the other heroes, their max skill. Grego, uh, like, Grego is like one of the first amazing hero I got. I got like really blessed with uh, Wind MK early on in the game. Like, I was leveling basically. I was like level, <laughs> level 30 or even like 25. That was like a, a year back and. Like people are like, wow, grats, man, grats. And then some people are like, yeah, pay to win, pay to win, you know. But no, I mean, free to play. And uh, I pulled him, was uh, was amazed. I use him for farming and all that. And then I, I figure like, damn, I might as well just get, get the AOE uh, hero. So I just, I just use uh, oh, the Fire Reaper. I was just farming like super quickly, like normal uh, uh, the fire stage. I keep forgetting all the, these names. And uh, at that point, like I had so much, so many gems from saving up, and also I used fire Inug Inugami. I used him for a long time, normal, and then hard. Uh, And then uh, I got Water Tyrant, and then I was, anyways, back to NB10. Uh, so far, so good. I mean, the time is—it's not like I said; it's not speed run, but it gets it gets the job done. And NB10 is uh, most of the time. I think NB10. You do just before you you're able to finish TO eight hundred. I mean TO eight hundred can be finished before and be ten. The thing is, is are you patient enough to just build the heroes, uh, control the, the the last few fights, the hard battles? Are you like do you have the time? Do you have the patience? That's that's TOA right there. Like if you don't you don't invest time into building those key heroes to just control the uh, TOE monsters and bosses and 
yeah, you need skill ups as well on, on most of them. But uh, yeah, some people just like to auto. Uh, that would be me. <laughs> but uh, I mean, TOE, I had to uh, just build up comps. So. Mav is just amazing. Colleen, now there's so many heroes you can just gain from uh, doing the, the questing in the game. They, they just give you. Win Griffin, uh, um, yes, Colleen. It's like those were a pain in the, the rear just to like get and then like skill up. I mean, you still need to skill up, but you, ju you can buy some skill up for two stars from the shop. Uh, you'll have plenty of just normal summoning uh, scrolls. You can just spam those and you end up with a bunch of skill ups. But of course, like win griffin that you just have to go all out and farm he's so good bernard you can hua can just go crazy sometimes with her own violent plus violent and then she skilled up, so she, like, it's eh, three, oh, you know, Grego, if he went another turn, it, it happens. That's, that's how I wipe here. He's on violence, so he can just go crazy. Like, Hua failed her uh, attack bar reduction. This could go terribly. All right. Rigil came in, saved the day. Sometimes you still have armor debuff, your armor, armor broken still, and then the boss goes and... You just lose some unit. Like, Rigel's really low here. Wow. Should be fine. He's slowed. I mean, I'm speed buffed. I mean, it's all good. Slow run. But when you start getting those runes, it's, it's going to take a while to actually uh, get some... Uh, some really good ones, but uh, the runes from here are uh, very nice. Put some uh, some vamp runes on your your farmer. You just if you want like safe runs. If you want to do uh, if you want to do uh, s scenarios like uh, in higher stages, uh, further in. Like that gives more XP per energy. You can run like a vamp Lucian, farm like the the last stage in the game. And some Lucians they don't even need vamp and they can just like they, they have such amazing stats. I think that uh, actually I'm not too sure about that. It could go terribly wrong. And don't they, these monsters like stun the armor break at least. I mean, Grego on Vamp is just pretty crazy farmer, but even uh, like Grego is not the AOE attacker. Then that means that he's not on violent anymore. Grego can be used multiple places. I have actually used Grego in, in raids for a while. That was before I got the Water KFG, uh, Fire Kung Fu Girl. She's just insane, so when you get her, you get your DPS. Uh, use Wind MK too, maybe not anymore in R R5. Yeah. Alright, guys. So, uh,. So thanks for watching this video. Uh, I'll be uploading uh, many more videos for summoning uh, Summoner's War. So uh, yeah, if you liked it, uh, well, you know what to do. And uh, I'll be uh, seeing you in the next videos. Oh, could it be the wife just before? Oh, great go. Alright, thanks for watching guys.
See you in the next one. Peace.